The Ministry of Health and Wellness commenced the rollout of the AstraZeneca COVID-19 vaccine on February 17, 2021. As of March 15, 2021, over 19,000 people have received their first dose of this vaccine. The Ministry of Health and Wellness is encouraged thus far by the interest shown and the uptake of the vaccine by our citizens and residents. The vaccine is provided on a voluntary basis and free of charge to the public. We will continue to provide accurate information about the AstraZeneca vaccine to the public to ensure informed decisions are made to keep our families safe from COVID-19. According to the interim recommendations by WHO, this vaccine has an efficacy of 70.4% against symptomatic SARS-CoV-2 infection. This is after both doses are received. The vaccine prevents the complicated form of the disease, hospitalizations, and deaths from COVID-19 in 100% of people who received both doses. The public is therefore reminded that with one dose, we are not fully covered as yet. Also, we need between 70 to 80% of our population to be covered with both doses to get the full benefit. This translates to over 126,000 people being vaccinated. As such, everyone is reminded of the need to continue adhering to the COVID-19 public health protocols and infection prevention and control measures that have proven to reduce COVID-19 virus transmission. This will keep us safe after receiving the first dose of the vaccine while the ministry ramps up the vaccination program. These include the following, wash your hands often with soap and flowing water or use alcohol-based hand sanitizers. Wear your mask which covers your nose and mouth. Maintain the physical distance from others and avoid crowded activities. At this time, Travelers coming into the country, whether vaccinated or not, must continue the public health measures, including presenting a negative PCR test done within five days and the 14 days of quarantine upon arrival for two main reasons. St. Lucia has not yet achieved herd immunity, so we remain susceptible to getting the virus. The level of transmission from persons who may be fully immunized is not yet established. It is well documented that the COVID-19 vaccine protects the person who has received it from becoming ill, but their capacity to transmit is not yet determined. The Ministry of Health and Wellness advises the public to remain vigilant and encourage their family and loved ones to receive the COVID-19 vaccine. The Ministry will continue to provide COVID-19 updates and on measures to protect against the virus.